Everybody in this world thinks that they are speaking the truth. It was Blaise Pascal, at least it's been attributed to him, where he concisely said that it is man's natural sickness to believe that he alone possesses the truth. And this is because we have a perception of the truth, a perception of reality that feels so real that this must be the totality of everything that exists. But it's not. It's analogous to a little raindrop in a potentially infinite ocean of awareness. And that greater ocean represents truth, which is all the knowledge that's in existence and all the knowledge that we have yet to gain. So because of that, we must be mindful and humble that we don't know everything. And unfortunately, because of this, our perceptions, which are always slightly different from one person to the next, are going to divide us, guys. It's tragic, but that's how it works. However, what's not nearly as divisive is our principles, our human principles, and this can unite us. And what are human principles? They are things that regardless of culture, religion, political party, we know to be greater values of humanity. And that's things like integrity. It's things like mutual respect. It's kindness. It's compassion. And simply doing unto others as you would have them do unto you. In fact, there's a term known as the golden rule, which goes back thousands of years. In fact, it precedes religion. It precedes all of these political parties. And the significance of this is I'm constantly seeing people that they become so passionate about promoting their perception of the truth that they totally forget about the principles of humanity, about treating one another with mutual respect. And then we start to degenerate and we resort to insults and we wish each other ill will when we probably share the same principles. And regardless of the best of intentions, guys, if we do that, when we succumb to that mousetrap, we unwittingly promote divide and conquer. And the only ones that profit from divide and conquer are ironically the people that do not share the same principles as us. And that's the real enemy. So remember, guys, whether it's a liberal or a conservative or an atheist or a religious person or whatever, the enemy is not somebody that shares a different perception because they likely share the same principles. No, the enemy is someone that pretends to share your perception, but inwardly and revealed through action, they have totally different principles. Rather than promoting truth, they deliberately promote ignorance and deception. Rather than promoting freedom, they deliberately promote fear. Rather than promoting unity, they deliberately promote division. And rather than upholding the principles of humanity, they deliberately uphold a system of elitism. And I assure you, the only way we will overcome this sophisticated foe is if we begin to embody the principles of humanity that can unite us and look beyond the perceptions which they weaponize to divide us. trying to free your mind, Neo.